Hello and a warm welcome to a stadium that always oozes passion at St. James's Park. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Newcastle United and they take on Brighton. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? So they start at 11 for Newcastle United. Well, it's a 4-3-3 formation with a centre-forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. And the contest begins. Mitoma. Well back. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. March. Isaac. Very quick thinking there. Well, when you have the best defensive record in the league, it's a clear sign of togetherness. And Newcastle have displayed that, Stuart. Well, they've been so well organised defensively. They press the ball from the front, the midfield players work really hard, and the defence are so disciplined. They're just so hard to break down. Cross fired over. Well, no problems defensively. March. No possibilities inside the box. Well, Beck, can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. And there's the delivery. Well, the goalkeeper made it look as though there was no pressure on him whatsoever. Isaac. Long staff. Determined block. Bruno Guimaraes. Can he finish this? Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile. McAllister. Can they nudge in front? Well back! And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance, and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Oh! 
So the action continues and it's up to the Magpies to wipe out that last goal. Just as well from the defensive point of view that he was able to make that interception and teammates around him. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Can they hit on the break? Will they profit from this situation? Dan Byrne. Here's Isaac. Nice looking pass. And it's with Isaac. Really important piece of last ditch defending. He was being pressed, but did his job. Joe Willock. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Bruno Guimaraes. A oh, terrific pass. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Now, who can he play it to? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Isaac. Not a great pass. So almost at half-time and not quite going to plan for Newcastle in terms of the scoreline in this one. Stuart, what have you made of their performance in the first 45? Well, they've not had quite enough purpose to their attacking play so far. It's all been a bit too predictable. But in the second half, if they can get more support to their strikers and play with greater intensity, they can certainly turn this around. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. And over comes the corner. And the problem not completely solved. Fabian Cher. It did look on for them, but not to be. And can they exploit the space out wide? Gross. March. Is this the moment? Well there. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. And it's with Isaac. It's a perfect challenge. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. McAllister. And room now out on the wing. Driven in. Spot on with that tackle. And it's gone behind for the corner. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, there goes the half-time whistle and the Newcastle players can get ready for the manager's team talk knowing full well they've really got to pull out all the stops in the second half.
Well, how wrong could I be? Before the game, we talked about their defensive record and how difficult they were to score against. But that certainly hasn't been the case here. They'll need to improve in the second half, that's for sure. And the ball is rolling again. And Newcastle left with a mountain to climb here in the second half. Can they respond? McAllister. Here's Gross. Alexis McAllister. Just cutting off the supply. Isaac. Longstaff. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Opportunity for them to get back into the game. And it's in! This game very much back on as a contest. Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. Well, underway again, it's a narrow 2 1 lead as things stand. Number 28, Joseph Willock. Number 23, Jacob Murphy. Mark couldn't number quite find his teammate. Number 24, Miguel Amron. And number 9, Bruno Guimaraes. March now. There to take it away. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Crossing opportunity. Trippier. Now with Wilson. Real chance. Oh, good work by the keeper. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And taken short. That is a really disappointing effort. Goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. Caicedo Denis Undav A oh, terrific pass Oh, wonderful save Well, he reacts so quickly there That's a great save Favouring the short one. Caicedo. Determined defending. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Adam Webster. Well, he could run onto it here. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Well, since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. Well, now I think after all that, they can exhale. Well, he lost his concentration there, but he's just about got away with it. Guimaraes Longstaff Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance 
And the counter-attack is on. Options available. This looks threatening. Well, it was a superb counter-attack, but no goal. Yeah, really good play. Won the ball back well and then countered with great speed. That deserved a goal. And a retrospective yellow card is the referee's verdict. Well, no doubt about it. That earlier challenge was a definite booking. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Miguel Almiron. Fabian Scher. Isaac. Interception to snuff out the danger. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And attempting the through ball. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. Playing it in, and the problem not completely solved. Will he finish? Well, what a stop that was. Who can he pick out? It might still be problematic. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Now can they counter clinically? But really sticking to their task defensively. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. A very timely interception. Ten minutes to go. Anthony Gordon. Well, still time for them to level it. Credit to them for winning back possession. And that'll be Brighton's ball. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Well, in the closing phase, and Newcastle up against it here. Well, it's been a tight match, but they haven't done quite enough going forward, in my view. It's all been a bit too predictable. A lot of passing, but not enough penetration. They have to get crosses into the box in these final few minutes if they want to get anything out of this. March. And mistimed the run, sadly. That's offside. given us away it is a decent looking attack here played into the box well clattered away read it well well wait don't go anywhere we're going to have five additional minutes now who can he play it to and just missing the target. Well, they're at least making chances. Now they need to be more clinical. Still pressing for a goal here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. 
This could be the equaliser. And he's lost custody of the ball here. And blocked for now. And the referee blows the whistle. That will be all for this game. And no points picked up by Newcastle United. What did you think of it all? Well, they've defended so well throughout the season. But today, they weren't quite as sharp, both physically and mentally. They just took a fraction too long to react to danger. And that has cost them badly.